Miss Millie, they think that they they think that I want to be like you when I grow up, and I do want to be like you when I grow up. It won't hurt. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a way of life. Yes. It's not. It's many things. I was fortunate to be exposed to many, many things. Gone to Africa, Cape Town, climbed a mountain when I was 72 years old, mm. and. Uh, Living, living out of the box. Yes. That's, and don't stay in that box. And it's kindness, it's an attitude. Our attitudes, are, it's very important. And we've got to work on our, work on our children mm -hmm. about attitudes. Yeah. Oh, you ain't kidding. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> Miss Billy, tell me this. What, what keeps you inspired? What makes you get out of bed every morning and be so inspired to, to tackle the day and to teach and it's to so fabulous. I keep guess doing it? Because I enjoy what I do. You know, I like to cook. I make I bake cakes and cookies. Oh, next time I'll bring cakes and cookies. Oh, please do. <laughs> and, um, <laughs> cake and cookies. Um, I'm a sort of junkie. I like sweets and everything. Yes. Mm -hmm. But I like to exercise. And when, as you age, you cannot sit. Mm -hmm. You can't sit and watch television, just sit. Yeah. On, only on Windy City Live, you can watch Windy City Live and then you got to... <laughs> no, but she's going to tell you how to watch it. Wow. You got to sit on the floor. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Wow. You got to sit and use your back. Mm -hmm. My goodness. Use your core. Mm -hmm. Yes. And it strengthens you. Right. Because when you get older, you got, you go down. Yeah. down. Right, 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 right. Yes, and your back is so, so I, straight. So I try to stay. Yeah. It has a lot to do with gram technique. I had an excellent teacher. Um, um, <laughs> Harriet Ross. She was, she gave me this technique. She taught me this technique when I danced with Joseph Holmes, and it's been worth it and it's something you don't get in a yeah. health club but it's in yeah. a dancing room. Miss Millie, you're such a groundbreaker especially as a woman of color and in the era that you were dancing as well. <laughs> um, but we're all around the age of 40. Yes, what would you tell your 40 year old self? What's the best piece of advice you wish you could have told your 40 year old self? Uh, there are many things about it's what you're doing now, you embrace other things in yourself. You learn about other people. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> you, learn about, <laughs> you learn about other people. If you stay in the box, right. I call it the box. Get out of the box. Get out of the box. Get out of the box. Try something and you've never tried before. That is right. I do something. Every decade I'm doing something different. You just started mm -hmm. modeling 15 years ago. Mm -hmm. Yes, I did. With <laughs> And um, a lot of things I just start with, but it's challenging, but it's so refreshing. It keeps me alive. Mm -hmm. right. It keeps me um, connected with people. With people. Yeah. Right. A lot of people don't get connected. And this is very important at this, at this time. Since we have a little cockatoo. <laughs> cockatoo? Uh, in the White House? In yeah, office? In the house. Okay. Oh. Got you. She does remind me of Mother Dear. Yes. Um, we've got to think better. We've got to think healthier, stronger, and especially women. Women, I don't know what he, if he thinks we don't have a voice. Hmm. I've had a voice since the 40s. I've been liberated since the 40s. And I don't need him to tell us what we can do. Yeah. <laughs> Miss Millie, we love you. Thank you so much for being here. You know, you see Ryan didn't cross his legs because he's not as flexible as no, you. No, I'm not. No, you well, we'll work on it. We, we need to work, work on, on it. it. Flexibility yeah. is very important. Yeah. Remember, ladies. Go All right. All right. Well, she's been a true inspiration as